At 4 p.m. this afternoon, former Vice President Inert Liu began a hunger strike in front of National Taiwan Museum. Liu is abstaining from food to support the release of former President Chen Shui-bian, who has been languishing in jail because of feral health. Liu believes Chen's continued imprisonment will only harm Taiwanese society, and his speedy release could help heal many social wounds. Former Vice President Annette Liu is hoping for a speedy release for former President Chen Shui-bian, either through medical parole or home confinement. Liu says she is saddened whenever she thinks of Chen being a prisoner. Chen has been in prison for more than six years, and now he is exhausted and sick. It's heartbreaking, and any person alive would be saddened by his situation. Only his release can help heal society. Liu's hunger strike is bringing new attention to this issue. Chen's son, Chen Zizhong, also relayed his father's concerns. Our father continues to hope that former Vice President Annette Liu wouldn't take up a hunger strike. A medical evaluation committee will convene a meeting tomorrow, Monday, and we believe they have almost reached a conclusion. A hunger strike is not a simple thing. Simply put, many of us feel weak if we skip just one meal. And with this cold weather and former Vice President Liu's advanced age, we are really quite moved by her actions. DPP Secretary General Joseph Wu also called upon the government to quickly release Chen. Vice President Liu is using her own body to call upon the administration for the early release of Chen Sui-bian. I am truly moved. Release him. Enough is enough. The presidential office replied to Liu's request, saying she should take care of herself for the good of the nation, urging her not to undertake the hunger strike. However, she remains committed to going without food until Chen is released.